Barry, speaking with defense for uh, Travis Sanheim, is this your second day on the ice today, Travis? Yeah, today was my second day, yeah. All right, and uh, good to be back? Yeah, it's awesome. I think uh, obviously it's exciting. I think we obviously have some unfinished business here, and, um, you know, we were going through a good stretch. So uh, to be back playing is a good sign. Um, there's, there's obviously more going on, but uh, it'd, be, it'd be awesome to get back and play and play and uh, get in the playoffs. And for us, we, we obviously got a good team, and uh, we're looking forward to the stretch run here, and hopefully we can get back playing. I saw – in a recent story that you were working on a farm for a bit, um, what exactly did you do during the pause besides do that to, to stay in shape and stay healthy? Yeah, so obviously uh, it's, a, it's a little bit different back home. Um, not, not as many cases, but uh, there were still restrictions. So um, you know, I kind of built a makeshift gym in my garage in, in Brandon and uh, trained there when I, when I could. And um, you know, Obviously I was helping out on the farm as well and uh, you know, I went two weeks straight where I was uh, I was out on the farm uh, in the tractor from seven till uh, whenever it got dark, and you know, trying to get the crop in the ground and, and helping my family out that way. So uh, it was kind of cool. I, I don't really get too many times where where I can go back and help out. Um, that was, I guess, one fortunate thing out of out of all of this. Where was uh, where's the farm located? Uh, right along the Manitoba Saskatchewan border, along the uh, number one highway. Um, just outside a town called Elkhorn, and um, so I guess that's kind of my hometown. But uh, yeah, it's about 50 miles um, outside of Elkhorn, and uh, yeah, we have we have about 1,500 acres, and uh, we, we mainly do just uh, canola and wheat are our two crops, and uh, you know it's between uh, me, and my brother, and, and my two parents uh, help out as well. You're talking about your twin brother Taylor, correct? Yeah, correct. Yeah, he he helps out. That's uh, he, he kind of works in that area, uh, works on the oil field a little bit, and uh, helps out on the farm as well. And you said 1,500 acres, right? Yeah, correct. Oh, how long does that take? Uh, yeah, it was. We we, we were about two weeks um, seeding and and uh, planting, and it'll be kind of the same thing with with uh, taking it off in the fall with harvest. But uh, kind of depends on the weather too. You got to get good weather, obviously, and uh, you get rain at all. Uh, kind of fills it up, and uh, you can't go for a little bit. But uh, for the most part, yeah, it takes a couple weeks to, to do it. All right, switching gears, how excited are you for these upcoming playoffs? Yeah, like I said before, I think it's super exciting. Um, you know, we got a good team, and, uh, you know, we, we were we were gearing up. Uh, you know, we were on a good stretch run, and uh, I think we – we got a good mixture between young and and uh, some veterans and uh, some guys in the prime and um, you know we're we're looking for for a deep run here in the playoffs and uh, a chance to win it all. Do you think the Flyers will adjust to uh, to being in a bubble for a while, including yourself? Yeah, it's going to be different. I think that's. Uh, I mean, every team's in the same same boat. So um, you know, we're we're not really sure what what it all entails when when we get there and I think that goes to the same for everyone else and we're just going to kind of learn as it, as we go and um, I think uh, I think we'll adjust as we as we go along and, and make the adjustments that are needed. Uh, are you going to bring any uh, activities you could do in the hotel room like a <laughs> Xbox or anything like that? Yeah I mean possibly we'll, we'll see what uh, what everything what, what's inside I guess and uh, what we can all do in there but uh, for sure I might, might consider that. Um, I don't game too much in the off season, so uh, and even during the season, just a little bit. So um, I guess if we get trapped in, inside a hotel, uh, we might have to maybe maybe take our our gaming systems. But uh, for the most part, I'll try to um, do some stuff with some guys, and especially if we're all trapped in the in the same bubble, uh, that way it shouldn't be too bad if we're we're doing things with with each other.